All right, what is up, guys? So this seems to be one of the items that will cause us to come near to our end of our 24 karat gold foil plated build collection. Um, if at any point in time you guys like this video, please do me a favor and hit that thumbs up and also click that subscribe to see uh, weekly content. Mondays and Tuesdays we do some uh, gold and silver. Wednesdays and Thursdays we do um, some business stuff. And on um, Thursdays and Fridays we do tackle box stuff, uh, aquariums. And on Sundays that's more of our, um, our random days. So... I think you guys are going to really like this one and appreciate this one. So it's a $100 bill. And check that out. Kobe Bryant. Most valuable player. Let's see if I can get it out of here. And I can't. Oh, there it is. So here we have it. Most valuable player. What I'm doing right now, I'm chasing perfection. And it says, even if the world's abandoning, abandoned, I can't read that word. I cannot read what it says right there, but. So, what happened to this man right here is pretty tragic. He was, um, he was an American basketball player for the NBA, and, um, he was number 24 on the Los Angeles Lakers. He was, um, born on August 23rd in 1972, and he died on, uh, January 26, 2020. Born in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania and died in Calabasas, California. So I think this right here, this right here is his basketball career then. Not his life. Because he definitely wasn't born in 1996. Uh, I was born in 1995. So definitely wasn't. But uh, so he... um. What happened to him, it was just really tragic. It was uh, him and his daughter, actually. Sadly, he, uh, on January 26, 2020, around, uh, it's happened around 9.45 a.m., him and his daughter, whose name is uh, Gianna, I believe it was Gianna, and uh, she was only 13 years old, and along with seven others, died in a helicopter crash, and it was said that the helicopter crashed into the mountains uh, or some hills around Calabasas. Uh, his body was uh, actually had to be identified using fingerprints and uh, the cause of death for all seven people was uh, blunt force trauma. And that was blunt force trauma for uh, fr from the crash. He was buried on February 7th in uh, in a private funeral in the Pacific View Memorial Park in Newport Beach, California. And he had a public memorial on February 24th. Now let's talk about his basketball for career while you guys look at this, uh, this note for a little while longer. This man was, some people say that he was, he was the best basketball player of, the, of all time. It's, it's very debatable. Um, like, uh, 
before I read you all of his awards, let's just let's just look at his career stats alone. Let's see, this guy, this man scored thirty-three thousand six hundred and forty-three points. He had seven thousand four, seven thousand and forty-seven rebounds, and six thousand three hundred and six assists. Like that is pretty amazing. For uh, but he played in in the NBA for around twenty years. To be honest, it was it was quite a long time. He he had. A very long run. It's just uh, so tragic to see what happened to him and his little daughter, only 13. And even he was young to die. Nobody deserves to die like that. Um, But um, this man made his, he put his footmark onto the, um, onto the basketball world. Uh, He won, um, he was a shooting guard for 20 years. Yep, so for 20 years he would. And that was for the Los Angeles Lakers. And with them, he won five NBA t- championships. He's won 18-time... He was an 18-time All-Star player, 15-time member of the All-NBA team, a 12-time member of the All-Defensive team. And in 2008, he was the NBA Most Valued Player and two-time NBA Finals MVP winner. He also played in the Olymp- uh, Olympics twice. Uh, I know one was in Beijing, and uh, the other one, I believe, was in Germany, I want to say. But uh, I'm not sure where that second time was. And uh, I think he got gold medals um, for, for that as well. But this is a little bit memorial piece for my collection, and... Uh, there's this five-time MVP, NBA championships right there. Um, my thoughts and prayers go out to the family of Kobe Bryant and um, all the fans. And it was tragic. And this is my uh, my little ode to joy for him. And stay tuned in a couple weeks because I should have a second a second order of him coming, but with. They have four different pictures out, and I'm getting all four pictures, so stay tuned for that. But I hope you guys enjoyed, but there you have it, R.I.P. Kobe Bryant. Thanks for watching, guys. If you uh, enjoyed, please hit that like and subscribe button. Don't forget to check those links down below to uh, help further this channel and allow for me to create more awesome content to bring to you guys. Thank you.